it's Tuesday again already, right? So, I was having this conversation with my son last night. He's 13, y'all, and um, Xavion is not really comfortable with change. So, we were just talking, and I explained, son, change is inevitable. And then I started thinking, there are so many adults who struggle with the same thing that he struggles with at 13. Not liking change. Unable to fathom the reason for the change or thinking that you can't change and being so fearful that you stay in the same place or not making better decisions. But as I explained to him, you know, things have an expiration date. And so when something expires, it's no longer recommended for usage. And in the same way, when a season is up, you need to move on. Stop trying to stay stuck in that season and deal with something that is out of date. Something that is no longer recommended for usage or you shouldn't be trying to use it anyway. There are so many things that have to change in our lives at all times. I mean, like things are always changing. That's never going to stop. And so when you get to a place where you fear the changes that are necessary, you are stuck. You know, sometimes people just get complacent and think, oh, well, this is okay. You know, this is, I might not like it that much, but this is okay. I, I would love to grow a little more, but now I'm just going to stay right here because this is familiar and it's okay. This is not okay. Just because it's familiar doesn't make it good. Doesn't make it enough. You have to learn to stand on the word of God, to trust God, to begin praying. If you don't have a relationship with God, that every day you have an opportunity to grow closer to him, to read the word. And so for some people, they don't understand that when you stand on the word and it's really, really deeply rooted within yourself so that you can, you know, tap into that all the time. You, I need to go to the Bible Anytime I'm struggling with any situation and there's something in there that is going to help me. And it may, it may not be that for somebody else. They may really not understand. And when you don't understand, I know God places people in your life who help you to better understand the word of God. So you have to think about that. And the trees, the trees are standing because of their roots. They're deeply rooted. Therefore, if the word is deeply rooted in me, I am better equipped to deal with everyday life, to deal with challenges, to deal with changes, and they're going to continue to come up. So, you know, I need to be in the right place because I don't, I don't always like change. Please don't get that twisted. Some days I don't want changes to occur either, but they are going to occur. And I want to do what I'm supposed to do when that takes place. Be deeply rooted. Be accepting of change. And positive change. Welcome that. It may not always feel good. But if it's good for you, go with it. It's Tuesday. You guys have a great week. I love you.